Happening today, the Motor City is adding extra eyes to more businesses by expanding its Project Green Light program. And our Shelly Childers joins us live with more on this story. Shelly? Malcolm Alicia, Project Greenlight Detroit began earlier this year with eight gas stations using high definition surveillance cameras linked directly to the Detroit Police Department, allowing cops to effectively track crime in real time. Now, this project has already led to several arrests this year. One of the first big arrests came after this woman opened fire on a vehicle at 4.30 a.m. at a gas station off Fenkel and Greenfield. And just last week, police showed us another incident Incident caught on green light cameras. A man walks up to a car and is given a gun. He puts that gun in his pocket, then casually walks into a gas station. That happened at Seven Mile and Hoover. Police saw that entire incident in real time and were dispatched to the business as this man walked into the gas station. In this case, both that man walking into the store and the man who handed him the gun were both arrested. This is some of the best technology. I mean, when you talk about a, an effective use of real-time crime, uh, I don't know of any place that's doing it like Detroit. And again, today, more businesses are adding their names to this growing list of the of businesses um, participating in Project Greenlight Detroit. Great news for customers and for businesses. Reporting live in Detroit, Shelley Childers, 7 Action News.